Hi, everybody. So glad you're with us. Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atlas, and we welcome you to the MGM Grand here on the Vegas Strip in beautiful Las Vegas, Nevada for tonight's main event. 12 rounds of heavyweights between Muhammad Ali and big George Foreman. Muhammad Ali's making his way to the ring right now. Boy, and he's not bashful at all, is he? Look at him, confidently making his way down for this contest. George Foreman's now making his way to the ring, and you can see how focused he is for the task at hand. All right, fellas, let's have a good clean fight. Touch him up and let's go. Well, they're scheduled to go to full 12 here tonight. Round one now underway. Unable to get to Ali, Ali blocked it. It's a mighty list of power punchers that Muhammad Ali has continually faced. You got Joe Frazier on there. You got George Foreman on there. And tonight, now this power puncher opposite him. Well, you have two problems with that power. Two of them with your face, Ali. One is, how do you land it? You have to find the perfect spot. Maybe catch him, pull him back with his hands down. You know, maybe time him as he's throwing a jab. But very difficult to do. And then the second problem. You have a guy that you're hitting that has a great what? chin. What? Clipping him with that uppercut. Big shot by George Foreman. Basic boxing, and it works so well. Put your punches together. A good combo by George Foreman. George Foreman's opponent knows exactly what the game plan can be now. That counter punch landed with some success. Now he goes to the gut with a right hand. A good block. Super two-punch combo by Muhammad Ali. And now he brings the left hand upstairs. Double up your punch. Solid right by Muhammad Ali. Muhammad Ali blocks that punch. And coming upon the halfway mark of this three-minute round. Foreman with a big uppercut. Ali with a right hand. Foreman's going to think about the next time he throws a punch because he just got hit by a good solid counter. And now just wasting away some time with that clinch. Nice job doubling up the jab by Muhammad Ali. He comes with the straight right hand. A good counter by Muhammad Ali. Ali's combination punching is working well here. Last 10 seconds. Muhammad Ali's right hand working well that time. He scored well. This round comes to an end. 
a round in which this fighter threw a lot of punches, didn't land a lot of punches. I'll tell you, what advice can you give to him if you're the trainer? Well, first of all, deal with the psychological part. Joe, don't forget, 75% of this game is psychological. Don't let him get discouraged because even though he's not going to say nothing, in his head he's starting to get discouraged. Just say to him, hey, listen, you're going to catch him. Let's shorten him up a little bit. And you know what? He's moving his head, so go to the body because now you're going to hit him a little in the body because the body's not moving. A piercing uppercut by George Foreman. Nice work, the left hand to the head. Foreman's punches just don't look like what they should look like right now, Teddy. I know he's thrown a lot early on here, but there's no oomph on them. Well, that's the other side of it. There's always a flip side to a coin, and the flip side... Oh, he is stunned. He could go down. Foreman's rocked, and his defense is porous right now. He could go down at any moment. But well, the problem is he's got the habit of blocking punches, and when a guy's putting them together... Big shot, the right came. What a big shot. He goes down thanks to that nonstop attack. It's like he was thrown into a blender of punches. <sighs> Foreman's corner needs to really get to their man after this round. They need to treat him after that knockdown. They also need to give him some sound advice. What's the advice you give him? Well, first of all, if they're going to get the chance to get to him, he better move his head. But the advice I would give him is, hey, you go out this next round and you kill some time. Tie him up a little bit right from the beginning. Don't worry about losing the early part of the fight or the early part of the round. Just get yourself back together. What an excellent two-punch combo by Muhammad Ali. Well, that was his intention, and that's what he's doing. Not engaging in the fight, but clinching. There are different kinds of power punchers, Teddy. Some are sharp and accurate. Some are thudding and impactful. Where does George Foreman lie on that scale? A bludgeoning kite puncher, a guy that you have a headache for about a week. He hits you with such thudding punches that it starts to just break you down as time goes on. But either way, he intimidates you with the force of the punch, with the effect of the punch. Foreman's hit by a right hand. Keep working the job. Now, this is a byproduct of his energy level being low. He's desperate, so he ties up his opponent. Well, this is part of being a fighter. This is part of being a pro in anything you do. There's times where it's all going your way. There's times where you got to make it go your way. you got to make an adjustment. He's doing what he has to do. Takes one, but gives one. Good work by Muhammad Ali. Muhammad Ali is quickly taking control of this fight early on with one single weapon of choice, and that is the jab. Yeah, the jab and the jab at the right time. He's catching his opponent every time he starts coming in before he can get started. Comes right back at him with a left hand. Oh! Oh, this is going to be close. He may be able to survive the round, but he has gone down now. Foreman's 60 seconds to recover hopefully will be enough for him. Now he's got good cornermen. He's got the right people in place to try to fix this situation. Yeah, and they got to work like a pit stop, you know, in the Indianapolis 500. One guy's giving the gas, another guy's changing the tires, you know, another guy's maybe giving the driver a little water. They got to do the same thing. Give him some water, refresh him a little bit, work his legs a little bit, and then just before he goes out, a little advice. What a nice big right hand from Muhammad Ali. Look at Muhammad Ali and his ability to avoid punches here. He's got it every which way. He's slick, he's smooth, he blocks and parries. Good defense. Really good job by Ali. Ali's got speed. And big, big shot comes crashing home. How about that power shot? And how about the replay?
reverb that's going about a county away with Big George hitting the canvas. <laughs> Ali's corner is already celebrating. His opponent unable to beat the count. <laughs> 